Fantastic. That's wonderful. So that's going to be taking place on Sunday, the 24th of September. And then two weeks after, pretty much, uh, on the Saturday, uh, mm -hmm. we, we we just, this this came together beautifully, didn't it? On Wednesday, who would like to yeah. go to the Schist Villages? And <laughs> hey, how about we, we pop into uh, the Berau Nectar Nursery Distillery uh, while we're over that way? Have a look at some of the villages. And yeah. why don't we do it slightly differently and have a bus that leaves from the Silver Coast, from Caldas de Reña, the, um, the, the place of the famous um, phallic ceramics, uh, which you can see <laughs> in the picture there. I don't know where you drink out of that cup. I dread to think. Uh, but that's looking good for um, our Saturday, isn't it? Sabado. Uh, yes, it was, it was an idea that came up on, on, on Wednesday, as you said. Uh, we had a lovely afternoon in Somerting the Port. And um, uh, I, I, I thought that maybe because um, all those expats that we met uh, in, in the Bay, um, probably they have never been to this area of Portugal. And it's a lovely area, central Portugal here. Um, and we have um, Aldeias do Xisto. Um, it's the Rede de, de Aldeias do Xisto. Um, it's a network of, of villages that are a total of 27, but um, of course we are not going to visit the 27 <laughs> villages. <laughs> well, you say that, but you did send me a message yesterday asking but, if 8 um, o'clock is too early. And I was thinking, are we visiting, if we're setting off at 8 o'clock, <laughs> are we visiting all 27? Um, but uh, no, fair point. I mean, we've got to get over there, haven't we? So, Hence the early start, and then and then we have the cycling, the cycling to the restaurant as well, isn't it? <laughs> we do have the cycling to the restaurant yeah. as well, um, which uh, I think I've got a video of somewhere. We'll come back to that, which ties yeah. to, ties in nicely <laughs> the, the tour of Portugal and our visit up there. Um, so yeah. let's 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 answer Pam's question here, which is done bilingually. Look at this. Uh, uh, Otocar parte de onde? Otocar uh, parte de onde? Quanto custa? Tem algum prato vegetariano? So, likely cost for this. I know we've put you on the spot here for a minute. Okay. You've got to find out with the bus company. No. So yes. Uh, uh, first of all, I'm contacting now because this was just the day before yesterday, right? Yeah, right. So, it, it, it is very, very, it's a, a very recent idea. Uh, because I, I I already do, I've already done a few visits to, of course, guided tours to the Chist villages, but it's not usually with a bus because um, I, I do that for three or four people, uh, so a small group. Yeah. Uh, but um, with a bus from Caldas, uh, I am contacting the bus companies from Calders uh, to know how much they they will charge to to, to come up here. Um, then, um, so about the costs, we can, uh, of course, on the on the the group, the WhatsApp group, wasn't it? Uh, it's yes. a WhatsApp group. Yeah, yeah, um, then on that group, I'm going to to answer all the questions as soon as I have the costs. Of course, I I will uh, put everything in. Of course. Yeah. Um, then about about the vegetarian dishes, yes. Uh, and again, I have to know in advance. But as soon as I know, um, I will tell them that uh, uh, there are vegetarian people. And they uh, let me tell you that this restaurant um, they have very very good vegetarian dishes. So um, if you tell me, if you let me know in advance, then you will have a very good meal there. There you go. So no problem for vegetarians at all. Um, and we're working on the cost. It's, it's not going to be astronomical. I, your your trips are incredibly good value, um, I've noticed. And I don't think anyone would have any complaint about that. I cost. always try. I always try, uh, you know, the, the best price possible. But uh, sometimes, for example, now the buses um, are a bit uh, dear now uh, because yes. of all the, the, the um, you know, the... Energy costs, right? The diesel costs and everything. Yeah. So, um, uh, yeah. So, oh, João Batista. Okay. João Batista is my cousin as well. Olá, bom dia. <laughs> João Batista. Olá, João. Great to see you here. Um, this is so fantastic. We're looking forward to that. And imagine if we've been to the Licor Bernal factory, there's going to be a sing-song on the coach on the way back. 
<laughs> or if you've got everybody up at eight o'clock in the morning to be on the coach, they'll all be asleep. All, all the no, but because, no, because, look, if you don't start at eight o'clock from Calder's, um, because you take about two hours to get here on a bus, isn't it? Yeah, it's uh, about no two problem. hours. Yes, and we can sleep so on the bus. If you, if, well. you start at eight, <laughs> if you start at eight, you arrive at about 10. And 10 o'clock, I think it's a good time to start. But if you if you prefer to 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 start the, a bit later, we can start later. But uh, we are not going to see as many things as we could. But I, uh, I'm I'm really excited about this. I'll, I'll drive over. It's to just Canada. it's just once, and then you know it's a uh, you. Uh, of course, I don't like to get up early. Uh, I don't I don't like to. To, to be very 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 early but um it's just once so yes if you are doing it for fun it's uh, it's not bad it's it's fine isn't it you make a bit of an effort and you get up and you're all bleary eyed and then we start you, you know you will, i'm sure we'll have a you, coffee or two on the you way can, you can sleep on the way for two exactly. hours so you can just take a nap uh, and <laughs> no, we'll be too excited we'll be too excited for that <laughs> there will be some people maybe we'll have a, you know like in the old days of smoking and non-smoking we'll have a sleeping a non-sleeping section of the coach uh, on the way over. So I'm really, I'm really looking forward to that, uh, Philomena. And thank you so much uh, for suggesting.